Indonesia. Wait till you see this tour, this cruise ship. All right, we're back on a cruise, but we're gonna give you another tour of a cruise ship. Yeah. The Carnival Venezia. This, we're sitting in the dining area. I don't know if you can see this, but there's a gondola in this dining room, isn't it? It's beautiful, it's yeah. It's beautiful. We're gonna take you from deck to deck, from the top to the bottom of this mm -hmm. ship. Are you ready? I'm ready. Let's just get right into this tour, ship tour, ultimate tour of the Carnival Venezia. And don't forget to... Like, subscribe, and click that notification bell. Welcome to the Carnival Venezia. Oh, look at this. View of New York. There's the pool in the back of the ship. They got two hot tubs and you could see New York City behind us. And make sure you're following us on Instagram. My wife is uploading something right now. All right, here we are. Interior room 6479. Let's see what's inside. All right, here it is. We got a bed uh, that they put two beds together, but you can separate it if you want by request. It's got a nice big screen TV, which I love, and a desk right there. Let's go check out the bathroom. Oh, a nice big shower. Nice vanity here. Love it. Let's see what the closet space looks like. There we go. Oh, we already got stuff in there. Here's the other side. You get your standard safe, which I always love on a cruise ship. All right, here's this track. Oh, do you see what I see up here? I see a rope course and the water park. Let's go check that out. Ah, uh, look how high that is. That's the rope course. People are on it now. We're in warmer weather for sure. Oh, they're lined up on this thing right now. I'll show you how high it is. Do you see the smokestack? That's how high you go on this thing. Don't you just love all these foyer areas? They're just stunning. And the way the elevator works, you press that button, you press your floor, and you get in, and it'll tell you where you're going. And you get in, and that's the floor you'll go to. There's no buttons in this elevator, so you gotta make sure you're pressing it outside or you'll go where everybody else is going. All right, look at these views. Sailing out of New York City at nighttime. Is this spectacular or what? It's beautiful. We got stuck in port for a couple hours, so we're a little bit disappointed, but man, how can you? say this wasn't worth it. And look at this sailing out of New York, the Statue of Liberty. Right foot, let's stop. Left foot, let's stop. Best part, freeze. Everybody clap your hands. Come on, y'all. All right, this is what the sail away party looks like on the Carnival Venezia. You just move, baby. Move any way you need. How do you do it, darling? Got me on my knees, on my feet. Oh, yeah. And they got some miniature golf here, too. I see some people playing cornhole over there. All right, here's hole five. Look at this. This is a challenging golf course for sure. Here's a hole, and over there's another one. All right, and this is neat. They got a nice walking track, but they also, on both sides of the ship, have some outdoor exercise equipment. All right, this is the track on deck 12. You can see it's pretty wide. I don't know, they probably don't have extra chairs set up on the left side of me here, but this is the track you can walk around that goes the whole way around the ship. 
And when you're walking in the middle of the ocean, there is something about it that's just amazing. It's the views to the right, the ocean. It's a must walking the track and make sure you're walking at nighttime because it's even better. There it is, the water slide and water park. All right, we're still on that track, but what I find very interesting about this cruise ship, and I'm not sure I've been on one where it's been like this, they got the water slides in the front of the ship. It's kind of covered there by all that equipment, but this is the water park. Oh, and look at this. They got clear tubes here. You could see your friends coming down. I'll be catching that in this part of the video. And look, they got more water stuff on the other side here. It looks like there's three different size water slides. Oh, parents, when your kids are on these water slides, this looks like a fantastic place to sit. They got a couple of clamshells. All right, right there is where you start on the highest water slide and you go down. Over there, you can see that rope walk course, but this is a high water slide for sure. There's a great overhead shot of the Carnival Venezia. All right, here's the piano bar on the Carnal Venezia. Uh, and here, this is the main foyer on this ship. This is where they have entertainment. You can see the big bar down there in the middle. Right now, they got some violinists. Don't miss the entertainment in this area because they put on all kinds of shows. Oh, and on here, this cruise ship, they got hibachi, an hibachi bar. Oh, and they got bonsai sushi in here. Here's the sushi bar. Oh, and on deck 11, they got some equipment here. There's two ping pong tables, uh, two foosball tables, and look at the view behind it. What is this? I'm not sure what this, oh, this is, uh, that's Star Game. But that's crazy incredible. I don't know how to play this thing. Another first. Are you kidding me? Indoor bocce ball? Oh, and here they're playing a bocce ball tournament. Look at this. Bocce ball right here. Yellow. Teatro Rosso, I guess this is part of the theater. Let's just show you what this looks like inside. Looks like they might be getting set up for bingo, but let me tell you, when you're on a cruise ship, you make sure you come on board to see some of the entertainment. And I'm gonna show you in this part of the video, this is the theater. All kinds of productions right here. Let's just show you.
there's an outdoor area. It's called La Strada's Grill. <laughs> You're all right. Oh, and they got a pizza station out towards the back of the cruise ship. Oh, and they got some basketball courts on this ship. And on deck 15 is the Serenity Lounge. And they got these maps everywhere to show you where you're at. Ah, uh, and here is the Serenity Spritzer Bar. It's in the front of the ship. All right, and my favorite place on any Carnival cruise ship has got to be this, the Serenity Lounge. They got a couple clamshells. They got these really nice seating areas. And it goes way over there. Let's keep walking here and see what they got. Oh, look at this place. You gotta get up pretty early probably to get this. Do you see this over here? And look how it's decorated with all these planners. Now, I'll tell you one thing, Carnival. This is probably the nicest Serenity Lounge I've ever seen on a cruise ship. And we continue on, there's more over here. Right there's the hot tub. And let me tell you, that's a big hot tub. You can get, I don't know, 12 people in that. And not only do they have umbrellas here, but they got chairs like this that you can oversee the water. Is this serenity incredible or what? It's beautiful. Oh, and they got drinks up here if you're getting hot. Oh, and they got towels on the Serenity deck. You get them right here at their towel station. Oh, and I just love the artwork on this. You, they got murals all over this ship. It shows you the attention to detail. Oh, and they got a spa. Here is Cloud Nine Spa back this way. All kinds. You get massages back here. I don't know if they got like one of them therapy pools. All right, and through the spa is the fitness room. Let's take a peek in here and see what we got. We got a bunch of ellipticals. And look at the view you got. All right, you got to find this on deck 10. This is the Lido deck. Look at the entrance here. Here's the map of the places we're going to be heading. But you walk out here is the Lido deck. Let's just check this out. This is where the enclosed area is. I see a pool right here is a stage they're getting ready to do something on. Looks like we got yoga this morning. Oh, and they don't have any shortage of life jackets here for this pool. Oh, look at all these slushy drinks right here. There's the tomato aurora. I don't know what that is. All I know is this is where you get your tacos. Look at all these Mexican toppings. I see refried beans, lettuce, tomato, onion. And they'll serve you right here. Oh, and look at all these toppings here at the toppings bar. Anything you could want. They got a good coffee station with their standard drinks. Today they got orange juice, apple juice, and passion for breakfast. Alito Marketplace. Look at the interior of this place. I love how it's decorated with all these lights. Oh, and you gotta have soft serve. I'm getting one of these. All right, right there's the cereal station, but if you back up, Look at these tables here. I love it. It's kind of got that feel of the horizon where you got these little canopies over the top of these chairs. Great place to sit and eat. And let's just take a stroll through the marketplace here. Show you what it looks like early in the morning before anybody gets up. Oh, there's a few stragglers. There's some of the fruit and Danish up there. 
There's the buffet, the morning buffet for breakfast. Oh, and there's some fried chicken. Oh, look at those mashed potatoes. Got to get some of them. Oh, look at the chicken, the mussels, the buttered mashed potatoes. And mac and cheese. And look at the view. This beats any other vacation cruising. They got a seafood shack on this boat. All kinds of lobster and shrimp. And I'm going to be getting one of them clam chowder bowls, I can tell you. Oh, make sure you're coming into the diner. Look at this dining room here they got set up. We're at table 131. This guy's guiding the way. And make sure you're eating in the dining room. You're not going to be disappointed. It's free. But look at some of these entrees from lobster to steak to all these fantastic desserts. I'll tell you one thing, you can't go wrong by eating in the dining room. Alright, there's where everybody is at 6.30 in the morning when I get up to get these shots. The Java Blue Cafe. This is the coffee shop. Now you pay extra in here, but it is great coffee for sure. Java Blue. I see milkshakes, blended frappes, coffee, espresso. It's all here. Now, over there's that pool sun deck. But look what's up top. They got seating areas. You can see here, over here, some beautiful shots if you want to sit and watch the ocean go by. And there's more on the other side. If you just want to read a book, this seems like a pretty quiet area so far. Oh, and look down there. This looks like it's the private area. They usually call it the Havana, but I don't know what it's called on this ship. The Burano Pool Bar is open this morning. Oh, and they got a jewelry shop on this Carnival Venezia. See, I'm getting that name right now. Keeps going on and on in here. This is a huge jewelry store on board. Look at all these watches. There's Belova Citizen. I know they got Invicta in here. I got one of them. Here's another one of their shops on board. Over here, it looks like your perfumes. And over here, it looks like your clothing in. All right, this is one of the pay restaurants. This is El Vagio. But let's just take a look and see what this looks like. Man, oh, this is big over in here. Look at this. This looks like a pizza bar back here. Look at these guys. You guys getting ready for lunch? No, for the dinner. Oh, for dinner. Yes. Got to get it ready, right? Look at that dessert. Here's the Frizzante Lounge where you can have a drink before your dinner. But that's cool. Is that the wine? three tasting glasses of Italian wine. All right, look at this. This is the Carnival Bar and Lounge. Another area where they play music and have bars, but look at the seating in here. It's pretty modern. <laughs> Make sure you're getting your picture taken here at the Pixel background shots. All right, this is Pixel's gallery. If you get pictures taken on board, you can walk right up to these kiosks and see them but this is where you get all your pictures that are going to be taken on board you pick them up here you get to view them all right and if you're familiar with carnival 
they got these candy stores called the cherry on top. Pop Rocks. All right, this is called the Gondola Lounge. Let's see what's over on this side. It looks like another bar. Oh man, there's a piano. They got something going on here. Oh yes, family number. Looks like this bingo. Number eight, no? I, no. Do you remember? Oh, maybe I, it's no? trivia. Right here is the Gondola <laughs> Bar. I don't know how many bars are on this ship, but let me tell you, you're not gonna be thirsty. Look what you can find on deck five. These little, I don't know, cabana kind of deals, but they overlook the water. What a view and what a private little area just to get away. Hey, Laura, Hi. look here. <laughs> what a place to just relax. Why is my camera coming on? I said, why was my camera coming on? Because I turned it on. Ah, Canal Grande. Wait till you see this dining room. So here's one of the dining areas. But look over here, which is unique. They got a gondola inside this place. Got seating the whole way around. Great staircase. This must be the captain's area right there. Hey, we're getting to warmer weather. There you can see both hot tubs and the swimming pool off the back of the ship. All right, here's the warehouse arcade. Let's walk in here. We'll get to this place. This is where you get to hang out. Oh man, it's a nice arcade. All kinds of games in here. Give your kids some quarters and send them into this place. Oh, there's a motorcycle machine. Oh, and a fishing game. Wild tuna. Guys, burger joint. Get your burgers right here. Welcome to Guys Burger Joint. Look at all these flavors. Plain Jane, straight up. That's a new one, pepperoni pizza. Oh, and you gotta come to Guy's Burgers. Here's where they fry them up. Look at all those burgers. Oh, and more cooking back there. See that back there? He is putting butter on those burgers. And after he puts that butter on, he layers them all up with cheese. Look at those. Oh, and they got a great toppings bar here. Look at all this. They got chili, mushrooms, all your American toppings right there. Tomato, lettuce, pickle. What you get, honey? A chocolate orange martini. Oh, and make sure you're watching an outdoor movie at the outside sea theater. Oh, look at this dessert bar. Coffee and cream, cheesecake, apple salty caramel. Oh yeah, make sure you're getting up on that top deck for the deck party. And there you go, the roof is open. Look at this. Let the sun shine in. All right, yeah, here's the port side liquor store. This is where you get all the deals when you're alcohol or cigarettes. Hi. Look at all this. Up there's the Baileys. I see shipwreck. Anything you could want. When you buy it, they will hold it until you get off the ship. Oh, and did I mention they got sales all over this ship? 
here's the Invicta watch sale, seventy-five percent off. Look at all these watches. Oh, and here's the Carnival store. Anything Carnival related is in here. Ships, Carnival clothes, and look who's aboard, Dr. Seuss. Cat in the Hat is here. There's another one of the characters. I don't know his name. Oh, that's Sam I Am. How you doing? <laughs> and look at this sports bar here. It's called Heroes. All kinds of TVs for watching the football or sports games. You gotta love this. All right, this is the Limelight Lounge. This is where they got the punchline or comedy, which are getting ready to, to get ready for. But right here is where you watch the comedy show. Oh yeah, free comedy. That punchline. Oh, they got an adventure desk. This is where you book all your excursions. Every ship you go, we think of you. Every song we sing, we sing for you. When you 